Hello friends, this is Durga from Technology Mentor slash ITVersity. I run a channel called uh, uh, ITVersity. Earlier it was Technology Mentor, but now I am in, uh, in the process of transitioning to something called ITVersity. You can go to YouTube and search for it. Um, and this is my channel. There are around 1477 subscribers and around 266 views. As of now, the channel is predominantly Hadoop centric. Uh, uh, there is um, uh, Hadoop administration using Cloudera, Hadoop administration using Hortonworks, MapReduce application development. Uh, and then there are some videos related to Oracle uh, uh, virtual machine technology. Um, but the idea behind this channel is to be generic across all the technologies. Um, and uh, slowly and steadily we would, we would like to add more and more content to this channel. That being said, uh, there are I, I run series um, like getting started, performance tuning, etc. And as part of getting started uh, series, I have a very successful playlist called uh, called Hadoop MapReduce Programming using Java. Uh, it is fine-tuned for Java professionals who is already experienced in Java, who have basic knowledge about uh, J core Java. They can go to this uh, playlist and they can uh, uh, they can learn how to set up their development environment and uh, start developing MapReduce applications using Java-based APIs. So in the uh, similar lines, I would like to add more getting started uh, playlists typically between two to three hours or probably to four hours to cover uh, uh, many technologies so that people can actually kick start their uh, learning process uh, on the vast array of uh, technologies. So in, uh, in that context, uh, from today or from this video, I will start uploading content related to getting started HBS. Um, development using Java. So HBase is a database which we will see uh, the details in a moment. Uh, so as yes, part of the subsequent videos. Um, and then uh, yeah, as you, uh, as people typically develop using MySQL or Postgres or uh, Hadoop or Oracle as a database, um, people can develop uh, their applications using HBase also. So uh, this playlist will facilitate about uh, setting up the development environment um, uh, for HBase, uh, setting up your Maven uh, or Eclipse IDE with Maven plugin, come up with the proper pom.xml with right dependencies for the HBase related uh, um, uh, development. And also we will see how we can interact with HBase uh, uh, as a developer using command line as well as and, uh, as well as the uh, job based applications. I will not go into too many details, uh, but I will try to focus on all the important aspects which the developer need to be aware of so that he can explore uh, further uh, in detail at his uh, uh, own pace. But uh, eventually there will be a uh, detailed playlist about covering all the important aspects of uh, HBase. Uh, which, which might take around eight, uh, six to eight hours um, but for that this will be the foundation so either you can pick up on your own or you can wait uh, for more content probably in next two three months I will have a detailed playlist for uh, uh, Java developers uh, in the context of HBS. so the agenda will be it might change a little bit to, uh, by the end of the playlist but at this time uh, I'm, at, uh, I'm assuming the agenda will be this. We will see the overview uh, of HBase, which includes the architecture and uh, many other things. And we will setting up plain vanilla Hadoop. Uh, uh, sorry, we will be setting up HBase on a plain vanilla Hadoop cluster using single node. And also, we will see how HBase can add it to uh, existing Hadoop clusters using distributions. Hadoop and HBase are tightly coupled, so you cannot learn HBase. Uh, isolated from Hadoop. So Hadoop has two main components, HDFS and MapReduce. HBase uses HDFS for the storage and then uh, it has its own components to actually uh, 
process or load the data into the database. And then we will see HBase command line interface. Um, we will see a uh, few important uh, and basic commands. And we will see HBase operations also. And uh, we will understand how the data will be stored in HBase. And we will see how to set up Eclipse with Maven plugin, come up with the bomb.xml and develop some Java programs which covers the basic operations using Java based APIs. All these things I will try to cover within two to three hours time frame uh, using multiple videos um, and, uh, and and then you can you can get your hands on the technology and explore further. That being said, I hope you will enjoy the content. Uh, if you want to learn others you can uh, uh, you can go uh, you can go to my channel, uh, click on playlists like this and you will see all the playlists that are available and you can learn whatever technology you are interested in. Uh, if you uh, if you like any video, please click on the like button. If you want to provide uh, comments or feedback, uh, if you want to provide feedback as, uh, in the form of comments, you can use the comment section of the video. You can also ask technical questions uh, in the comment section of the video. And if you have not subscribed to this channel yet, please do so. We will see a lot more content over time like this. That being said, thank you. Bye.